Fracking. Oh! <laughs> You're not running out on me, are you? Sorry, no, I was just... <laughs> no, it happens all the time. <laughs> Look who's keeping the tooth fairy busy. Oh, yes, you can, you can say that. Shall we? Sure. Okay. <laughs> Look. Mary, I know coming to the dentist can be frightening, but I assure you, we're not monsters. Speak for yourself. Oh, <laughs> Sue, this is Mary. Mary Sue. Hi. I, you know, I, I, I just don't see why I have to have my teeth pulled. They feel perfectly fine. Sure, sure. Your, your teeth feel fine now. But those wisdom teeth tend to shift around, and uh, before you know it, you have a mouthful of trouble. Recent improvements in modern dentistry have rendered the process practically painless. Well, that came off. Oh, a few tugs of this, and you won't remember we had this conversation. What do you say? Well, you know, I, I do have. Oh, um, some deep breaths through the nose. Num num time. Very still now. Okay. Oh, have you ever heard the original story of the tooth fairy? Mm -mm. No? Mm -mm. <laughs> Creepy stuff. And all done. <sighs> tooth fairies were <clears throat> a sight different than the winged women we often think of today. Winged. Is that a word? <sighs> Originally, they were bone grew. A mighty race of creatures that lived beneath the earth and feasted on the bones and teeth of the dead. Hey, it, bone? And teeth. Yeah, <laughs> yeah when a uh, child would lose a tooth, parent would bury it in the ground and um, the Gru could sense it and they were appeased. Mary, can you give me a, a gauze? But eventually the uh, humans evolved and moved away into cities. So they no longer had land to bury their teeth. It adds up. Three. Relaxed?
Cut. She's on? He's up. Oh. Huh. Okay. All right. Ready to go? There we go. Okay. The nurse at the desk will have instruction. There you go. Yeah. Call us if uh, you have too much pain. Oh, and let's uh, get that son of yours in here. Sooner rather than later. 